Hello diecast monster truck racing fans and welcome back to our spooky decorated track where today we have 16 custom painted zombie runner monster trucks ready to do battle but can they get this race in before it starts to get dark and even scarier here on our track we'll find out soon but first let's meet the truck starting with El Toro Loco followed by Biker Zombie then we have Monster Mutt Dalmatian up next is Blonde Zombie. Then we have Monster Mutt. Followed by the Spooky Sparkle Smash, always a fan favorite. Up next is Racing Stripes. And finally for this team is Dragon. Yes, these are custom painted, bloody, spooky, zombie runner monster trucks, perfect for Halloween. Yeah, they may be a little scary, but they put on some great races. These zombie runner trucks are not only gonna have to battle each other, they're gonna have to battle the spooky decorations on the track. And if we don't get this race moving soon, it's gonna get dark and even scarier. So what do you say we hurry and head back on over to the pits and meet the other eight trucks, starting with Wolf's Head, followed by Megalodon. Then we have the original Zombie. Look at that Monster Ma Rottweiler ready to go. Then we have Scooby-Doo. The pink monster mutt poodle followed by the red burn victim zombie and rounding out today's tournament we have the husky these are some incredible custom painted die cast zombie runner monster trucks which of these trucks is your favorite why don't you find us on facebook and let us know if you like these spooky races and if these trucks aren't fast enough to win their matchups here today they're gonna end up over here in this enchanted forest with the zombies and skulls i'm getting scared just looking at the forest so what do you say we leave and take a look at today's racing bracket and how the trucks will line up and heading up first to the starting gate for today's tournament we we have Dragon taking on Wolf's Head, followed by Racing Stripes lining up against Megalodon, then Sparkle Smash will be facing Zombie, next up is Monster Mutt taking on Monster Mutt Rottweiler, then Blonde Zombie will be facing Scooby Doo, Monster Mutt Dalmatian will be racing Monster Mutt Poodle, Biker Zombie will be going head to head with Burn Victim Zombie, and El Toro Loco will be racing Husky. These are some awesome zombie runner matchups. So, what do you say we head up to the track and get these races started? All right, here we go. First to the line, we have Dragon taking on Wolf's Head. Now, let's go racing. Green flag, here we go. Wheel to wheel coming out of the gate, down the ramp into that first shot. Big air from both trucks. They're side by side on the second obstacle where Wolf's Head has problems and Dragon smooth over the crushed cars to take the win. What a super smooth, fast run by that zombie runner, Dragon, like it was running away from some zombies itself. But Wolf's Head didn't have that much luck with the big crash. Let's take another look from the track cam. Coming down the ramp, both these trucks are side by side. Wolf's Head maybe ahead just a little bit. Bit. has a harder landing starts to flip off that second jump as dragon smooth over the crush cars for the win what a run from that truck what an awesome first round matchup from these two custom bloody painted die cast monster trucks and in that one it's dragon taking the win to be the first truck to move into the second round of racing we'll see more of that truck later on but for now let's head back up to the gates and get the next pair started and for this next matchup, we have Racing Stripes taking on Megalodon. Let's go racing. Here we go, Racing Stripes a little ahead, coming into that first jump, all but goes off to the side, hits a zombie, lands on a spider, and Megalodon passes for the win all the way into the graveyard. Wow, what a wild run, taking out some of these obstacles, some tombstones falling. We have a zombie down on the track, a spider got smashed just like they should. Let's take another look. Coming down the ramp, watch Racing Stripes in that black lane. Starts going off to the side, nails that zombie stand hit by the track. What's that zombie doing there? Megalodon for a super smooth win. I knew right from the beginning that these spooky obstacles were going to play havoc with these trucks. And in that one, it's Megalodon passing for the win at the last minute to move into the next round. What a race. Now let's head back up to the starting gate because I'm getting word the next pair is lined up, ready to go and waiting on us. All right, next up, we have Sparkle Smash in the black lane, taking on Zombie in the gray lane. Let's go racing. Both trucks so fast out of the gate, coming into that first jump. Sparkle Smash a little ahead. Oh, they get together off the second jump. They both start to crash, and Sparkle Smash flips for the win. Lands on a backflip jump. Check that out. But what a wild run from both of these trucks as they crashed off of that second jump. Let's take another look from the track cam and see what happened coming off of that landing. As the gate drops, both these trucks extremely fast, but Sparkle Smash pulled away by about a horn. They get together on the first jump, crash again on the second jump, and just barely makes it to the line, flipping all the way. What a run. 
When you get two zombie monster trucks racing aimlessly down the track, you're bound to have some big crashes. And in that one, they both take a tumble, but Sparkle Smash takes the win. What a wild race. We'll see Sparkle Smash a little later on again. Now let's head back up to the starting gates for the next pair. And up next is a Monster Mutt mashup with Monster Mutt taking on Rottweiler. Let's go racing. Gate drops. Here we go. Both trucks extremely fast, but Monster Mutt with problems goes way out to the side. Rottweiler over the crush cars, flips over the line and lays there like it's begging for a treat. Who says you can't teach old zombie monster trucks new tricks? That was wild. But Monster Mutt had a big problem off of that first jump. Couldn't even make the landing. Let's take another look. As they're coming down the ramp, watch the black lane. Monster Mutt with problems right off that first jump. Goes sideways, hits the side obstacle and flips. Monster Mutt Rottweiler rolls over the finish line for a tree. What a run. Well, just because you're the coolest original Monster Mutt around doesn't mean you're the fastest in the races. And that one, it's Monster Mutt Rottweiler making it to the line to move into the next round of racing. That was a wild race from these two Monster Mutt monster trucks. But now let's head back to the starting gate because these trucks don't want to wait. And up next, we have Blonde Zombie in the black lane and Scooby-Doo in the gray lane. Let's go racing. Green flag gate drops and they're off. Wheel to wheel out of the gate. Coming down into that first jump. Huge jump from both trucks. They're side by side. But then Blonde Zombie pulls away over the crushed cars and takes the win. Both of those trucks were so fast. The first half of this race, what was going on? That was awesome. Scooby-Doo was really giving it a great run, but Blonde Zombie just pulled away. Let's take another look. As the gate drops, both of these trucks are extremely fast. Coming down the ramp, they're wheel to wheel in the air. Smooth landing big jump off the second obstacle as scooby-doo has problems over the crush cars and blonde zombie pulls away for an awesome win what a run that scooby-doo monster truck sure looks awesome dressed up in that zombie runner costume for halloween what a great truck but in this one it's blonde zombie getting to the line first to take the win and move into the next round that was a great run now let's head back up to the starting gates for the next pair and have some more fun and here we go with another Monster Mutt matchup with Dalmatian taking on Poodle. Let's go racing. Green flag, here we go. Wheel to wheel out of the gate. Coming down the ramp. Big air from both trucks. They're side by side off the second jump. Dalmatian flips. Poodle flips and it's too close in the line to tell. Wow. These Monster Mutt sure do like doing tricks on their racing runs, but I'm not sure that's the fastest way to the line. But which of these two Monster Mutts took the win? Let's take another look from the track cam and check it out again. As the green flag flies, both of these trucks are so fast. Coming down the ramp side by side in the air. They land in there side by side off the second jump over the crush cars at the line. Oh, what? It is too close to tell. They both get there at the same time. Let's take another look from the track angle one more time and see if we can tell. Coming down the ramp, big jump from both trucks. They're side by side over the crush cars as they both crash at the line. It does look like Poodle takes the win by about a half of a tire over teammate Dalmatian. Wow, what a crazy wild run from these two monster trucks. These monster mutts are incredible. These zombie runners, we gotta love them. What a race Poodle and Dalmatian have put on. But in that one, it is Monster Mutt Poodle taking the win to move into the next round of racing. Sorry, Dalmatian, just not quite quick enough on that fire call. <laughs> now let's head back up to the starting gates and see what other trucks will be joining her. And up next, we have a team zombie battle with Biker and Burn Victim Zombie. Let's go racing. Here we go, side by side out of the gate. They look like they're holding hands in the air. They're side by side. Oh, they both do a double flip off the second jump. Wow. Burn Victim Zombie just barely makes it to the line. Look at that. By a tire tread. Takes the win. What a wild run these two had half track. They both were in a nose wheelie. Both did a double flip. And Zombie takes the win. Let's take another look. As the green flag flies once again. And wheel to wheel off that first jump. Check them out. They both start to nose over. Double flip, but burn victim zombie flips all the way to the line. What a wild race. <laughs> All of these zombie runner monster trucks sure are putting on a great show here today, but I don't know if any of them are quite as good as that zombie matchup. But in that one, it is Burn Victim Zombie just barely making it to the line to take the win. What a great race. Now let's head back up to the starting gate because the next pair is waiting on us. All right, here we go with El Toro Loco taking on Husky. Now let's go racing. Green flag gate drops and they're off. Both again so fast coming down the ramp. Oh, but Husky has problems. Goes off to the side. Hits the zombie. El Toro Loco over the crush cars. Tries to do a backflip after taking the win. Wow. That's one way to celebrate a victory. To try to accomplish a backflip after the finish line. But what happened to Husky over here? Almost ended up in the graveyard. Wow. Hooked up on the fence. Let's take another look. 
As the gate drops, both of these trucks so fast coming down the ramp, wheel to wheel, but Husky makes a turn. I'm not sure if it's chasing that eyeball or saw something in the graveyard it wanted, but El Toro Loco takes the win with an attempted backflip. Wow. Monster Mud Husky with some problems, taking out a zombie and jumping up on the fence like it's chasing the mailman, making a delivery. Wow. But it is El Toro Loco taking the win to move into the next round. So we'll see more of that truck soon. Speaking of the next round, what do you say we head on over to the pit area and check out the trucks moving on into the second round of racing? Right now in this tournament, we're really lucky that it's still light because with this spooky track, we're moving into the dark of night. These spooky obstacles might just come alive. Oh, I'm getting scared. So what do you say we meet all the trucks moving into the second round starting with dragon and sparkle smash then up next we have megalodon taking on rottweiler followed by blonde zombie and burn victim zombie then we have monster mud poodle taking on el toro loco these trucks have done great but which of these eight trucks will be moving into the next round up first for this round of racing, we have Dragon taking on Sparkle Smash. Let's go racing. Green flag, here we go. Sparkle Smash blown away, coming down the ramp into that first jump. Big air from that truck. Dragon off the second jump, tries to hit Sparkle Smash and crash it, but Sparkle Smash takes the win. Wow, what a move by Sparkle Smash. Pulling away just enough that Dragon couldn't get to it. What a wild run by Dragon trying to take out Sparkle Smash. As you can see from the shadows on the track, it's getting a little dark, so let's take another look at the track cam now. Coming down the ramp, both these trucks so fast. Big air from Sparkle Smash, smooth landing. Pulls ahead of Dragon to take the win. What a wild run from these two trucks. That right there has to be one of the smoothest runs we've seen all day from Sparkle Smash. As Sparkle Smash takes the win and will be the first truck to move into the semi-finals. Dragon couldn't quite pull it off in that race. Now let's head back up to the gates for the next pair because they're up there waiting on us. And up next, waiting in the dark shadows, we have Megalodon taking on Rottweiler. Let's go racing. Green flag gate drops. Here we go. Both starts so fast. Coming into that first jump. Oh, they get together in the air. Megalodon with a huge crash. Rottweiler starts to flip, lands on the wheels on the crush cars, and somehow makes it to the line. That was quite the wild race from Monster Mutt Rottweiler. I think that truck did three flips before it landed on the wheels and powered through for the win. What happened to Megalodon? Why did these trucks get together? Let's take another look from the track cam. As the green flag flies, both these trucks are so fast coming down the ramp, but coming off that first jump, they hit. Megalodon does not clear that first obstacle. Monster One flips, flips again, lands on the wheels, and takes the win. What a wild run. If I was Megalodon sitting there in the middle of the track, I'd be a little scared right now. Looks like the spiders might be closing in. But with that wild race, it is Monster Mutt Rottweiler flipping for the win. What a great run from that truck. Now let's head back on up to the starting gate because we got two more ready to go. All right, here we go with another double zombie battle. Blonde zombie taking on burn victim. Let's go racing. Gate drops and they're off. Wheel to wheel out of the gate. Coming down the ramp, but blonde zombie has problems off the first jump and landing. Hits a zombie eyeball and a spider. Burn victim takes the win and ends up in the graveyard, but doesn't hit any tombstones. Wow. Maybe a little luck here on that spooky night, but blonde zombie wasn't quite so lucky. Taking out a zombie, an eyeball, and a spider all in the same run. Let's take another look from the track cam and check that one out again. As they're coming down the ramp, watch Blonde Zombie in that black lane. Goes to the right off that first jump and landing, hits a zombie, hits an eyeball, lands on a spider as Burn Victim takes the win. What another incredible zombie runner matchup here in this monster truck tournament. And in that one, it's Burn Victim Zombie taking the win to move into the semifinals over teammate Blonde Zombie. What a run. Now let's head back up to the starting gates and see what the final truck is moving into the semifinal round. And up next, we have Monster Mutt Poodle in the black lane taking on El Toro Loco in the gray lane. Let's go racing. Here we go. Poodle a little ahead, coming down into that first jump. Big air from that truck going to the side. Corrects, goes back over in front of El Toro Loco. They crash and Poodle gets to the line first. Wow. That truck almost went completely off to the side of that first landing over where the zombies are. Turn to come back across the track in front of El Toro Loco and take the win. What a great run from Poodle. Sorry, El Toro Loco. Not today. Let's take another look from the track cam watch poodle in that black lane coming down the ramp so fast as problems goes off to the side turns to correct back into the other lane crashes in front of el toro loco and el toro loco helps poodle win what a run well viewers that zombie runner monster mud poodle putting on a driving show here today what a great save good enough to take the win and move into the semi-final round what an awesome run from monster mud poodle we'll see more of that one later now what do you say we head on over to the pits and check out all the trucks moving on into the semi-finals 
Well, viewers, look at this. It's starting to get a little more dark here on this spooky track, and we were warned about everything getting scarier at night. And these trucks are now over here in the haunted forest. I'm starting to get scared, are you? These 12 diecast monster truck zombie runners have been eliminated from today's tournament, and now they're hanging out over here in the haunted forest where who knows what's going on. I see some zombies, skulls, and even a witch has joined. Uh-oh, what is gonna happen next? But how about now we meet the trucks moving on into the final round. And the first two trucks are Sparkle Smash and Burn Victim Zombie. Followed by Monster Mutt matchup with Rottweiler and Poodle. Which of these two trucks can win these races and head up in the final round for a chance at their podium spot here on the Halloween race? What do you say we head back on over to the starting gates and find out now? Here's your first matchup for the semi-finals. We have Sparkle Smash taking on Burn Victim Zombie. Let's go racing. Here we go, Sparkle Smash blown away, coming out of the gate into that first jump. Big air from both trucks, Zombie a little faster off the second jump. Sparkle Smash flips and Zombie passes for the win. Both trucks end up over there by those other tombstones. That's a little spooky, wow. Sparkle Smash had the lead in the beginning but couldn't hold the landing and lost it to Burn Victim. Let's take another look. As the gate drops in the shadow, Sparkle Smash starts to pull away just a little bit into that first jump but as problems off the second jump starts to flip burn victim zombie passes for the win what a run from that burn victim truck well we know sparkle smash is one of our viewer favorites here on this channel but in that one it's burn victim zombie taking the win to move into the finals and sparkle smash will have to race one more time to try to secure third place in this tournament now let's head back up to the starting gates for the next semi-final matchup and see what trucks will be joining them Okay, and here we go with Monster Mutt, Rottweiler in the black lane, and Poodle in the gray lane. Let's go racing. Green flag, here we go. Both trucks so fast like they're chasing a tennis ball at the park, but Rottweiler has a hard landing, flies over into a zombie and crashes. Poodle smooth over the crush cars all the way into the tombstones at the end of the track. Wow, what happened to Rottweiler off of that first jump? That truck was so fast coming down the ramp, but couldn't clear the first obstacle. Took out a zombie and an eyeball. Let's take another look. As the green flag flies, both of these mutts so fast coming out of the gate down the ramp, but some reason Monster Mutt Rottweiler can't clear that first obstacle, flips into a zombie as Monster Mutt Poodle smooth for the win. Well, Monster Mutt Rottweiler had some really fast runs earlier in the tournament, but in this one it's Poodle taking the win, moving into the finals, and Rottweiler will have to race one more time against Sparkle Smash for third place. What a wild matchup from these Monster Mutts. Let's head on over to the pits and check out the matchups for the finals one more time. All right, viewers, we're almost there going into the final round. Here's your matchup for third place. We have Sparkle Smash taking on Monster Mutt Rottweiler. And then for the final round matchup, we have Burn Victim Zombie taking on Monster Mutt Poodle. Which truck will take the overall win here in this spooky Halloween tournament? Let's head up to the gates and find out now. And in the dark of night, here's your race for third. We have Sparkle Smash taking on Monster Mutt Rottweiler. Let's go racing. Here we go out of the gate. It is Sparkle Smash a little ahead into that first jump. Big air from both trucks. Sparkle Smash starts to pull away over the crush cars and takes the win all the way into the graveyard. Wow. Monster Mutt Rottweiler didn't have enough to take down Sparkle Smash and had to crash itself over the crush cars. But what a wild race from these two trucks. Let's take another look from the track cam and check it out again. As the green flag flies, Sparkle Smash so fast coming out of that gate, you can barely see it in the dark of night. Lance puts the power down, pulls away from Rottweiler, smooth over the crush cars to take the win. What a race from that truck. What an incredible run from both of these Zombie Runner custom painted monster trucks and Rottweiler's done great here all day. But in that one, it is Sparkle Smash taking the win in third place here overall in this tournament. What a great run from that truck. Now, what do you say we head back up to the starting gates for the race everybody came here to see? That's right, viewers. This is your final round for the spooky Halloween matchup Zombie Runner edition with Burn Victim Zombie taking on Poodle. Let's go racing. Green flag gate drops and they're off. Both trucks wheel the wheel out of the gate coming down the a huge air from both trucks, but Burn Victim starts to flip. Poodle smooth on the crush cars, flying across the line for the win, ending up in a wheelie. Celebrating its victory with a little freestyle there at the end. That Monster Mutt Poodle was so fast. What happened to Burn Victim Zombie with that flip off the second obstacle? Couldn't control the landing and got beat. Let's take another look. 
Both these trucks so fast coming out of the gate down the ramp. Big air from both trucks, but Burn Victim has problems. Flips as Poodle pulls away over the crush cars for the win here in the dark of night. What a run. All right, viewers, that Burn Victim zombie has laid down some incredibly fast runs here earlier today, but in this one, it's Poodle taking the win and celebrating with the wheelie after crossing the line. What a great run from that zombie runner monster truck. Definitely deserves that top spot. What do you say we head on over to the winner square and check out all the trucks that deserve to be there? We sure hope all of our viewers have enjoyed this custom painted zombie runner race. We're still not sure what these other zombie runners are doing over here in the haunted forest. We'll check on them later. But now it's time to take a look at these top three trucks for today's tournament. These trucks have done incredible and apparently they're up there celebrating with the skulls and zombies now. In third place up there on that bronze podium, we have the Sparkle Smash zombie runner. I've always loved these zombie runner monster trucks that were designed by our son Reagan who you'd see on the reveals maybe one day spin master will do these and in second place we have the zombie runner burn victim zombie that truck was fast here all day long but couldn't quite pull off a win in the finals and speaking of the final round winner for our time for adventures zombie runner race we have the pink poodle that truck looks absolutely incredible up there on that gold podium what do you say we take a minute and help all three of these trucks celebrate Thanks again for watching Our Time for Adventures. Until next time.